College basketball's most dominant team right now is trying to stay undefeated tonight. Not Duke, Purdue, or Baylor, but a team from a small Jewish university in New York City. The, the, the Yeshiva Maccabees haven't dropped a game since before the pandemic. 44 wins in a row. Now, on the fourth night of Hanukkah, the team's trying to make it 45. But the players say their real goal is much bigger than just keeping the streak alive. CNBC's Contessa Brewer has their story. Kicks it to Reef down low. Reef lays it up and lays it in. What a find by Ryan Terrell. This Division Three team has the longest active winning streak in the NCAA. It's the kind of record even legendary teams pray for. All the doubters and people saying that Jews can't play basketball, uh, we want to prove them wrong and, you know, really set an example for all the kids that doesn't matter where you're coming from, doesn't matter who you are or what, what you believe in, that you, you could succeed in life. Ryan Terrell aims high. He wants to play for the NBA as the first Orthodox Jew. As a college junior, he's a star player for the Maccabees, recruited from Southern California to New York, lured away from Division I schools. But his faith and this basketball program made Yeshiva University his pick. I had a few other options coming out of high school to be able to play, uh, stay religious and, and play basketball at a high level and uh, try to win a national championship. Yeshiva University in Manhattan has just 2,600 students. All of them, including the basketball players, are required to participate in intense Jewish studies for hours a day. Some players wear yarmulkes on the basketball court. Some observe the Sabbath, so games are scheduled around it. Prayer is central to daily life, though not every player is orthodox or even observant. Everybody's on a different scale of of religion. So I think just having that and knowing how to respect each other off the court brings brings a lot to the team when we're on the court and it, it helps us with our chemistry and teamwork. The coach preaches selflessness and says it's been the glue to keep this team focused during pandemic ups and downs. The fact that we have that mentality kind of throughout from player one through 15 is, uh, is really the main reason that we've had success. And the long streak of victories is now attracting attention from NBA talent scouts and high school players from all over the country, some who aren't Jewish. This program has been around for, for decades, and we've never had this kind of success before. Um, and it's a testament to the hard work of the student-athletes and to the coaching staff.